Okay, hello guys. So this is the Galaxy A12s with the code name is A127F on Android 12, one UI Core 4.1. And in this video, I will show you how to read this font using Magis, okay, using the patch boot method because uh, still it doesn't have a custom recovery that work. Okay so all the files and instruction i will provide in my blog you can check the link in the description box okay stay tuned and check it out okay hello guys assalamualaikum we meet again with Tom Bob. this time we have the galaxy a12s and in this video i'll show you how to root this pawn using custom recovery and also mages okay so first thing today let's check the exciting system okay you can see right here it's it is uh <coughs> it is shown galaxy l12 but with the code name a to uh 12f i uh, sorry i mean code name is SMA1277 and we can see right here the code name is the SMA127F okay so basically it is the Galaxy A12S okay because the Galaxy A12 the code name is different it is the A125S so it's different okay so let's go to the super information and you can see right here it's using the <clears throat> Android 12 on one UI core 4.1 okay so first thing you need to do is enable the developer option just hit the build number five times go back go back and make sure that the OM unlock has been turned on okay it's uh it's the same for all samsung phone the newer one so basically you just turn off the phone and press the volume up volume down and then plug the usb cable and press volume up for about 10 seconds and it will automatically reboot and it will unlock your phone okay if you don't understand you can check on my previous video on samsung you can find it so basically the first step is done we have uh enable the lock put loader and don't forget to remove all the emails and samsung account okay so let's now turn it off because we want to go to the facebook mode and then to go to the facebook mode you need to press the follow up follow me down at the same time and then plug your usb cable okay let's try it Okay, when you see the screen, just press volume up one time and it will boot into the download mode. Okay, let's go down the pawn and now let's switch the screen. So, this is the file that we needed. Okay, basically, it's contained the boot image that's already been patched with Magis. Okay, it's work on the binary 6 like the firmware that we use okay if you this if you saw before like this okay the ap underscore blah 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 a blah 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 xxu7 okay so this is the binary 7 okay it works on the binary 7 okay android 12 okay let's copy this pad and you also need odin and also samsung driver okay so i'll provide all the files in here and also the steps you can check the link in the description box okay and check the auto reboot go to the ap button and paste the pad and select the file just hit the start button okay make sure it's already connected and just hit the start button okay it will start flashing 
and when it's completed you can go to the uh, recovery stock recovery to factory receptor upon and now let's try to go to the stock recovery like usual we need to force reboot the pawn let's press the volume down and the power button at the same time wait for seven seconds and when the pawn rebooted click we switch to the volume up and power button okay so i've uh traverse try for several times <laughs> and eventually we put into the stock recovery okay now navigate this in volume up volume down let's hit volume down and hit ok with the power button select factory reset and it will format the data okay now it will boot the pawn and we should wait until it goes to the home screen and now we are in the home screen and first thing you need to do is you have to connect to the internet okay by using a sim card or wi-fi because for the first time you have to wait until the OM, the OM unlock is shown okay let me show you let's go to the about points for information and build number okay Go back, go back again, <clears throat> developer option, and you should wait until it's shown up. Okay, it, it is usually just take about 30 seconds because if you haven't wait for connect to the internet, it will not show up, and you reboot your phone, it will boot loop, get boot loop. Okay, so make sure to connect to the internet. Okay and let's find the menus if it's if it's not shown you must install manually okay let's go to the file manager you can always copy the apk the menus one okay we are using the delta canary go to the settings and give permission to install unknown source after it finished we can open the menus and it usually it will ask to reboot the pawn okay so after that you can update to the latest version or uh, install model and other stuff okay okay require additional setup just hit ok and it will automatically reboot the pawn and now we back to the home screen so i have installed several files root checker repair and other stuff okay let's open images and you can see right here we have successfully installed images okay from here you can uh set the option the judges put the protection magic side and other stuff now let's open the root checker just for fun okay hit check and grant it your a127f is rooted <clears throat> okay now root beer okay it root it reads the subinary and the SA Linux flag is enabled. Okay, you can always hide this one using the magic set if you want to. So you need to check the option and also safety net is fail because we still doesn't have safety net fix in magic. Okay, so after this you can play around, install safety net fix, L pose and maybe other stuff. That's all, guys. I hope it helps you. See you in the next video. and i hope you like my video if you find it very useful please give it a thumb and i also have lots of video about routing custom rom and lots of fun okay especially xiaomi samsung realme asus and other stuff okay 
uh, you can find in my video maybe some of the video will be useful for you okay guys if you subscribe it will make me excited to make a new video and that's all stay self stay safe stay health and wassalamualaikum